Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am here with another Empties Regrets and Reviews for you. No, I don't know what number I'm on. I just keep on chucking them out. Right, so we're going to jump straight in. Okay, so the first thing I'm getting rid of is some eyelash glue. In fact, I have not one but two lots of different eyelash glue. So the first one is an, I'm not going to try and get this in, it's an eyelash glue. Law, 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 a law. Mm. Not too sure. Um, this is a super fix. It is clear adhesive. It is a teeny tiny bottle, and it comes with your eyelashes. Uh, freaking brilliant. It didn't stay in forever, um, but it was really good, and I did enjoy it. I tend to have individuals stuck on now, so I probably won't purchase that again. But if for some reason I'm away and I rub my eye when I'm asleep and they all fall out and I start to panic, I would definitely go for that brand because the glue is fantastic. I also have this Salon System Natural Lash Individual Lash Adhesive. Now, on the website it did state it was semi-permanent. It was alright. Like, it was alright. Do you know what I mean? Like, it stuck your eyelashes on, they lasted about a week. <laughs> Which isn't very good, I know. Uh, the eyelash I've got now, some of them have been stuck in from day one. They're literally like, some of my lashes are quite far away from the roots. my eyelashes have grown. Um, I do need to find the time to remove them all and have them redone, but I'm just like, just, just top them up because I ain't got time. <laughs> so, definitely recommend that. I actually found that on eBay. Uh, really, really good. And it was only about four or five pounds, maybe. Loved it. The next thing I have got is a Your Good Skin. Um, this is a balanced skin moisturiser. You're supposed to see visibly healthier skin within 28 days. Um, it was nice. It was really, really good, actually. If I got another one, I would be very happy with that. I'd just keep plastering it on my face, and I really, really enjoyed it. I just stuck it next to my bed, and I just squeezed and kept covering my face in it, basically. Um... I don't think I'd go out my way to buy it because you can't, I can just go into a, this is right, this is my thing, I'm lazy, okay, and I hope to God there's more people out there like me, I'm lazy, I go into my supermarket and I will pick up something that's there, if this isn't there I don't buy it and it's not in the supermarkets because I don't, I don't see the point in spending money on something when I've got to pay postage and packaging so it annoys the hell out of me, okay, uh, but if I ever got it again, or if I ever walked into a local shop, or like a, just like a little, you know, side shop somewhere, and it had it in, I would probably purchase it. There. I also have a MAC strobe cream. This was just a tester. It's teeny tiny look, and it's disgusting, and it's empty. I really liked it. I didn't, however, like it around my nose. I suffer quite bad with very oily skin. Now, I've never suffered with this before. My skin just should be dry and bank. And now... I am literally getting so oily around here. I'm finding some things to help, but like literally I touch it and my makeup is peeling off because my And even if I don't touch my face, throughout the day I notice like my my, my makeup can be eaten away. It's just, oh, I hate it. But if I put this on, it makes it 14 times worse. So I do like it. I like putting it here to give me like a nice natural healthy glow, shall we say, underneath my foundation. But yes, I definitely love it. And I would buy it because there is so many good things in it. Right. Next I have two Clinique chubby sticks. They both look the same, pretty much. They're not. One was um, super strawberry and one was roomiest rose. Now. I got this one for Christmas, I got a set of, I think it was either five or six, and I got this one, this was a tester as well, but it, it was a big tester. But, in this tester, does it say, it was a 1.2 grams, uh, I don't think this one gives you how much is in it, it was probably about the same. And as you can tell, there's bits all over it where the lid fell off in my pocket. The lids aren't very good. That's all I'm saying. It's like there needs to be a, a... For an instance, if you look close, this one has a line and this one also has a line. And that's all you get to hold it on, whereas that one's a lot larger. It just kept falling off in my pocket. Um, they're both pretty flat. They're both pretty similar, to be fair. I loved them. I would use them again. I don't think I would purchase... A Clinique chubby stick. I don't think the colour lasts that long. Yes, yeah, so I do like them. I just don't think it lasts that long. 
so yeah i've just i enjoyed them and they're lovely lipsticks but they're not lipsticks they're more like lip balms and i just mm, i don't don't know i won't purchase them but they were them and i really enjoyed them so i have a sponge mm -mm. <sighs> I got bought them and I was so excited to use them, but they're just so hard. Like, my whole face moves when I prod my face. It's just, they don't, even when they're wet, they don't really grow or anything, or they don't get any softer either. Um, I did enjoy using the yellow one for a bit, but they're just too hard, and I feel like I'm battering myself. <laughs> like, I normally just do that, and I actually feel... I don't know if you can hear that. I'm not even hitting that hard. So, yeah, uh, no, I won't use that again. It was from Spain, anyway. So, um, I don't know if I'll ever purchase that again because I don't go to Spain very often. I also have some wipes. Now, these are from Aldi, I believe. Uh, in fact, yes, it says Aldi on the back. These are 3 in 1 cleansing facial wipes for dry skin. Very gentle. I really liked them for a cheap buy just to take my makeup off at night uh, when I'm being lazy and I don't want to clean my face we all do it I know these were just so lovely to try and yeah very happy with them and I'll definitely repurchase them the next time I go and do my shopping which should be later today probably I have here a model co conceal and correct stick it is green it looks like this um i think i've used it once <laughs> i think i've literally used it once i don't really use it so i don't know if it's because i'm not 100 percent sure on what to use it for but i just don't use it and i have no intentions of researching and finding out so it's going Sorry, but it's going. I, I, I just, just, it's gone. It's going. I'm getting rid of it. I'm sorry. I just, I, I haven't used it, and I'm trying to get rid of things that I don't really use. The last thing on my list is these beautiful IMV Express La Express. Uh, uh. I Envy Express Lash Extensions. This is the fluffy volume individual lashes. You get 56 lashes in these teeny tiny pots and I got them in a 10 mil form. Now, these are beautiful. They look like this. Um, they were quite thick at the bottom, like wide. They wasn't thick so you could see them. So you could stick them on quite quickly. You know, individual at home lashes. They were great. However, I only got on average two sets out of these and you'd have a few spare because by the time I'd fill them all in, I start off where I like, do it, miss a bit, do it, miss a bit, do it, miss a bit. So it spreads them out. And then I'm like, oh, they look so pretty. They'd look even prettier if I filled in the gaps. And then you fill in the gaps and then there's not many left. Um, I usually have around six or maybe eight to last me. There's top ups if any fall out and then they all have to come off and I redo the next set. Yeah. I um, love them. I definitely repurchase them. Um, if I went back to like individual individuals at the moment, I literally have. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what the different name is. So you've got like individual lashes that come as a little fan and then you get individual lashes that you stick like two, maybe three to one eyelash. I have those done at the minute. I don't know what the corner is going to go do my eyelashes, please. <laughs> I'm mental, I know. I'm mental, I know. So, yes, they are the eyelashes that I love. Uh, I don't know if I zoomed in. We'll zoom in again. They look like this. I purchased these off eBay, but they're also on a website called Lash Art. Love them. I'd like to thank you so much for watching this Empties, Regrets and Reviews. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Please click here to subscribe, click here, check out one of my videos and click down here to see a video that YouTube has selected for you. I'd like to thank you so much for watching. Take care. I'll see you in a few days with another video and bye-bye.